WBO featherweight champion of the world, Shakur Stevenson, was back in action recently for the first time since this lockdown's been imposed against a very beatable Felix Carabao. He broke him down, did what he needed to do, and won in six rounds. It was up at super featherweight, which Shakur could easily go to soon. I would prefer he first has a unification fight with our own Josh Warrington before he makes the move up. More interestingly was what he said around the same time regarding Manny Pacquiao, 41 year old WBA welterweight champion of the world. He thinks that the Filipino could get the better of Kennedy Golovkin. He thinks Golovkin is basically on more of a downward spiral at the moment than Pacquiao is, which is just crazy to think. Professionally, Golovkin was probably starting to enter his prime around 2010, just as Pacquiao was exiting his peak. You think of all the wars Manny Pacquiao's been through, the fact he's a smaller man that don't tend to age as well generally, that's how it normally works in boxing. But at this stage, it's possible now that Pacquiao is holding up better at 41 than Golovkin is now at 38. It's crazy to think. It seems to just defy biology. Whether Pacquiao would be able to use his speed, and bear in mind, we're talking about a fight that's very likely not going to happen here. I think Golovkin's going to want that third fight against Canelo. But trying to picture it, even with Pacquiao's speed, the way he zigzags, he moves, peppers you with the left hand. It's very hard to see him. Even now, against a faded Golovkin, to go up, up to middleweight, I don't think he would be able to get away with it. If Golovkin was a more basic fighter, if he just swung for your head all the time, maybe, maybe. But the fact is, Kennedy has always been considered. He works behind a steady jab. And while he's never been the fastest puncher, he has shown that a well-timed jab, particularly against Canelo, can find the mark repeatedly and dictate in a lot of the rounds. Golovkin is still very good at cutting off the ring. Pacquiao being so much smaller will be forced to work. The physical strength difference, of course, that's what Derevyanchenko had. He's got that physical strength difference, which helped him arguably beat Golovkin late last year. Pacquiao nowhere near as physically strong. For all his speed, for all his experience, for the great movement he has, it's very hard to see him being able to take out Golovkin at this point. What do you think? There's no chance it's happening, no way. But if they were to fight, if the lockdown was lifted soon and we could get the big fights on again, if we get Gennady Golovkin at 38 years of age and put him against today's Pacquiao at 41, <laughs> is there any way Manny Pacquiao could somehow outpoint Golovkin? Because he's definitely not knocking him out.